Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to It's All Me. Tonight is a very special night because Tiny and I are at Walmart and we are currently going to be shopping for Samaritan's Purse Operation Christmas Child. This is something that we've done for the past couple of years and we do it through our church. And what it is, if you are unaware, is you get these little labels here and you have little age brackets, two to four years old, five to nine years old, 10 to 14 years old, and choose between a boy and a girl. And then you fill this, this shoe box up, just filled with gifts and of your choosing, and then it gets shipped around the world to kids in need. We get to go inside and we get to just figure out what we want to gift these wonderful little kids. And not only are we gonna gift them with, you know, fun toys and color books and things like that, but also we're gonna give the gift of Jesus and salvation for Christmas. And that's the most important thing. And that's the wonderful thing that we get to do through our church and to be able to serve people around the world through this by giving back to them, to those in need. So just to give you an idea of kind of what we're gonna be looking for here tonight, we're gonna be looking for some wow items and other gifts. Wow items would be something like a doll or a soccer ball with a pump, a stuffed animal, um, other things like hygiene items and school supplies, just whatever we uh, kind of deem necessary, as long as it doesn't fall under the do not include list, we get to put this in the, the box and then we take it to our church tomorrow to meet the deadline and get these shipped off to make sure that these guys get these wonderful gifts from all sorts of people uh, for Christmas. So let's head into Walmart and let's fill these shoe boxes. Yeah. Okay, so we're at our first spot that we're looking at, which is the coloring books and activity books. And Tiny found this little one, cause she's shopping for a little girl, five to nine year old little girl. Yep. And cute little kittens and animals inside. And little activities. Yep. And then I'm shopping for the same age little boy. And obviously when I was a kid, Jurassic Park was huge. And I was huge into dinosaurs. I don't think you can be a little boy and not be attracted to dinosaurs. So inside this, you got activities, you got coloring pages, all sorts of different cool things. And some pictures are a little bit more mature, some are a little bit younger, so I think it fits that age range really well. So I think we both found our first thing. Yeah. So we're gonna go ahead and put those over here for our boxes. All right, so next stop was an obvious choice. We were gonna look at crayons and I'm more of a colored pencil kind of guy myself. So I like crayons. Tiny is a crayon and person. And I have confetti crayons, glitter crayons, Colors neon. of the world, neon. Oh yeah. Just your basic. Ooh, cosmic. Cosmic crayons. Whoa. Tiny's gonna go home with some cosmic crayons of her own. <laughs> Washable ones, I got markers. I liked markers as a kid, but I lean, as I got a little older, I always lay, leaned more towards colored pencils, especially because you can get like so many for a pretty decent price. These are only 97 cents. So again, we, we have a certain budget that we're sticking to. So the cheaper things that we can get, the more that we can gift the kids. So I'm gonna just get the, just your basic crazy art colored pencils. And tiny. These kind of limited colors. There, it's only 94 cents, but I would rather have more colors. I don't like this brand. I was kind of a picky child. <laughs> you knew you were a little bit bougie when you rolled out the Crayola crayons when you were a kid. Crayola was the only crayon. I mean, anything else was way too waxy and didn't even like color properly. I think this one's perfect though. It's 16 colors and only $1.50, but you get There's everything you need. 24 down here for a buck 37. What? But it seems at least. Oh my. All right, well, I think that's going to be the one. All right, she's made her choice. What'd you choose? 24 crayons. Crayola brand. So we've added a few things. I'm going to have Tiny showcase her stuff. All right, so I've added this as a possible wow item because obviously, look how amazing it is. Like, the pom-poms and color, it's just amazing. And the best thing about a bag is you can put all the things in the bag and it's like Christmas when you open it up. And for me, I added three items. I added a pencil sharpener for any pencils they might have as well as their colored pencils from me. I added a solar calculator. One, because every kid deserves a calculator and to not have to do math on their own. And then I added this little water bottle, little pop top water bottle with the uh, dinosaurs on it. it, says roar. So we're uh, now we're in the hygienic 
aisle. We're going to look at maybe some toothbrushes and washcloths and bars of soap. So we relocated to another Walmart for more variety and I've now finalized my box. Uh, I got this as my wow gift it is a Hot Wheels multi-pack and then Tiny and I are going to be splitting some scented markers. So that'll be fun. They smell like uh, fruit, scratch and sniff. And then a pair of Jurassic World sunglasses, still sticking with my dinosaur theme. And then some Jurassic World socks as well, multi-pack of socks. So gotta stick with the dinosaurs because us, us boys, us guys, we like the dinos. So we're sticking with that. So now we're finalizing everything for Tiny's box. We have a few more things to find and then we're gonna call it good. Tuni found her last two items. What'd yes. you get? Okay, so as a kid, well actually in my regular daily life, I absolutely love puzzles. Mm -hmm. So really wanted to get something like this. This is a hundred piece puzzle, Disney princesses. It will be a super fun activity for her to do with her parents maybe. Or friends. Or friends. Um, and then this, which is six headbands in different colors, bright, fun, exciting colors that she can wear to match any outfit. And, and they're ouchless. Yeah, and they're ouchless. So, yep, that pretty much covers it. All right, looks good. All right, so we're back home. We got all of our shopping done. We're just gonna run through the items one more time. Just gonna give you a, a reminder of what we, what we bought for our boxes. Item number one for me is gonna be the Colortivity Dino Danger. Going along with that uh, dinosaur theme, we got the Jurassic World socks. Looks like we got six pairs. We got the Jurassic World sunglasses. Has a little Jurassic World symbol there. Camo and back there as well. I added some candy cane flavored chapstick for the holiday. Got these really cool Hot Wheels zombie cars. As a kid, I loved big trucks, so this was a, a must buy for me. Then we got Pencil sharpener for the colored pencils. And then, like I said, colored pencils for the activity book. We got some scented markers that are gonna smell like fruit. A little solar calculator. And then a nice cool little water bottle, again, following on that dinosaur theme. So those are my items. And then we'll have Tiny run through her items one last time. All right, so we got the wow item. This is like the most wow backpack I've ever seen in my life. Got some creative, fun coloring activity. Got a colorativity book and some crayons. And then these scented markers, which I can smell through the bag and smell really good. They literally smell like our childhood. Yeah. Um, and then got this 100 piece puzzle, which will be so fun to do by herself or with her friends or parents. And then a couple of um, like fun girly things. So like these light up um, toothbrushes. They are amazing. I absolutely love them. Mm -hmm. um, and then some orange mango glass chapstick and these amazing headbands. Yes. So that pretty much covers it for girliness, fun, learning, and just amazing times. Yes. And Christmas. And the last step is we just get to fill up our boxes and get it ready for them and put the label on and we're good to go. All right, well that wraps up tonight's adventure for Samaritan's Purse, Operation Christmas Child. Our boxes are complete. We just now have a few more steps to, to finish up before we turn them in at our church tomorrow. I hope you guys enjoyed this little look inside what we think is a really, really awesome cause that we try to do every year. It's just to give back to those people that just don't get what we get at Christmas. A lot of people don't get things under their trees. A lot of people don't have trees. A lot of people don't have Christmas get-togethers. And if we're able to give a little bit of what we have 
to them. Uh, it's, it's truly an honor and a privilege to do so. If you want any more information, again, that's Samaritan's Purse Operation, Operation Christmas Child. And hopefully you guys enjoyed our adventure tonight at the, the Walmart, looking for the different things for the different uh, kids that we got. So um, on that note, I know it's a little early, but we want to wish you guys a Merry Christmas, a Happy Holidays, and also a Happy Thanksgiving, because that's coming up here soon. So on behalf of Tiny and me, as always, remember, it's all knee and no foot, and we will see you in the next one.